For years now, the Kamaniab Village Council has been dealing with the housing issue through the Public-Private Partnership Initiative under the Build Together program and says it has constructed close to 50 houses since 2009. Last year, with the launch of the Mass Housing Program, the funds for the Build Together program were withdrawn, leaving close to 300 urban which were surveyed without being serviced. Village councillor Nico Somaib says this setback now created a vacuum for some urban to be left unserviced until the Mass Housing Program kicks off at the village. The council received 15 million in this regard from the National Planning Commission to be used over a three-year period, subdividing that amount into 5 million for each year. However, it has also been requested to upgrade the existing infrastructure, such as roads, from the annual 5 million budget. But currently, we as a local authority, we are busy. We have services. We have survey 305 events whereby we will service them with water and sewer. Mm -hmm. Also to address these houses through mass housing. But we as a local authority are getting, are, are experiencing a problem with, with mass housing as we have not been part of this program. And also the way mass housing is operating is now middle and income group. Some Kamaniap residents who spoke to us on condition of anonymity say they were entirely not satisfied with the Build Together program as they complained about the alleged poor quality materials used to construct the houses as this cost them thousands of dollars in maintenance in addition to the monthly installment payments they had to make. They say even before the program was withdrawn, their complaints allegedly fell on deaf ears. Councillor Somaib did admit and acknowledge the residents' complaints, stating that the faults were found mostly at the houses, which were constructed after 2010 with low-quality bricks. The council then intervened to have those particular bricks replaced with the super bricks and advised the beneficiaries under the program to source their own builders instead. Blanche Corres, NBC News, from Kamaniab in Kunene region.